Murray the squirrel, hanging round McMurrayville, looking for food dropped on the ground. Murray the squirrel, trying to get her belly filled, that's why she's hanging around. She's looking high, she's looking low, she's going where she shouldn't go, she doesn't make a sound. Here she comes, look out below, Murray the Squirrel's in town. Let's all go down to the roundabout. Let's all go see what it's all about. Follow the rules going in and out. Don't be a fool at the roundabout. Stay to the right and I think we just might. Uh oh, Murray the squirrel's got a treat and she's trying to escape through the building. She heads down the hall, wonder which way she'll go. Is she going to try and escape to the right? Maybe she'll try and escape to the left. One thing Murray doesn't know, McMurray's got itself a roundabout now, and the rule at a roundabout is stay to the right. So escaping is not going to be as easy as it usually is. Sure, you can still go right, you can still go left, but you've got to follow the roundabout rules. If you're heading to the right, super easy. Head towards the roundabout and take a right. Head down the hall. But if you're going to go to the left, roundabout rules. You can't just go to the left anymore. You head down the hall, stay to the right of the roundabout, curl around the table, and then head down the hall. So what if you're just heading straight? Well, that's pretty easy. Murray heads down the hall, stays to the right of the roundabout, and keeps moving forward. How about if you're heading the other direction and you want to go to the library? Well, roundabout rules. Stay to the right, curl around the table, and there's the door. So what do you think Murray's going to do? Escape to the right, the left? Let's check it out. Oh, Murray's decided she doesn't want to stay in the building at all. So she loops all the way around the roundabout, comes right back the direction she came, and out the door. See you later, Murray, and thanks for following the roundabout rules. <laughs>